Good afternoon, everybody, or evening, or whatever time it is, wherever you're at. This may look a little bit new, this little area here. It is. It's because we're on the map of Al Basra. And it's April 2nd, 2017. We are privileged enough to be showing you this today. Whoop, whoop. Um, and uh, I'm here with Hyper Evo. Hello, everybody. He's going he's gonna to go through this with me. This is Squad Ops, and we're going to be running an operation called Desperado. It's going to be on this new map, Al Basra. You can see it. It is so beautiful. It's awesome. It's going to be great. Well, we'll go through the command and stuff real quick. Uh, action is going to start not too long from now. So we'll cut to the chase real quick. I'm going to go over, obviously, the U.S. forces. I'm following then. Hyper is going to be following insurgents. Yep. So my commander is none other than the man himself, Lish. He helped develop this operation uh, on very short notice. We never actually had access to the map, so we did it from basically this view from above. <laughs> and uh, and uh, it's actually, I think it's going to be exciting. It's basically a roadblock in the middle of the in the middle of Alberza. We'll go over that in a second. Lish is going to be commanding. His squad leaders are going to be Digit, Schmitty, and Barton. And I'll kick it over to Hyper. He's going to tell you what's going on on the insurgent side. And on the insurgent side, our commander is going to be Karma, and then his SLs are going to be Jaffe, Mighty, and Hamlet. And it looks like they're actually uh, getting ready to take off right now. <laughs> yep, I haven't seen the live chat yet, or the, so we'll uh, we'll get that going soon. Yeah. For the most part, if anyone's been watching, they've been streaming it all day, or at least CCFN's been streaming it. Now we're going to do it. We'll stream a little bit later with the NAS as well. But this map is awesome. It's called Albuquerque. Uh, it's I think Duck Hunt made it first for PR, and now it's been remodeled and revamped, or I guess introduced to Squad by Chance Bra. Yep, and you're it's correct. Gorgeous. Yeah, it is just gorgeous. Everything about it is so awesome. This is the village on the west side. You can see all the little walls with the fields in there. And I mean, this is just a great fighting area in itself. There's tons of excellent little compounds scattered across, little bridges crossing the water everywhere, and, and roads, plenty of roads. We're going to turn over towards the big city. There it is. Look at that. It's, def it's bigger than the town I live in, for crying out loud. <laughs> and some of these buildings are up to eight stories high, I think, seven or eight, maybe. Yes, it's ridiculous. And like now, now the hurricane's a. Uh area where do I look at the ground first or do I look inside the buildings first? Exactly. And the thing is you can go in all these, like all these buildings they can go in. There's, it's not like you walk, you can only select a few because they're all blocked off. No, every single one has doors, stairs, way to go up. Yeah. It's definitely going to bring a different uh, gameplay for us in the, uh, these events now for sure. Oh yeah. This is, this is going to be awesome. This is just brings a whole new level to urban warfare in the entire squad community. Uh, Tristan Peterson's asking if there's a countdown to start as of yet. Uh, no, the approximation is probably less than five minutes. We've gone over, uh, I've already seen the US brief. As you can see, I'm above the insurgents right now and, and at Hyper is too. They're place, this is a roadblock operation. Basically the US are gonna come, they have to destroy this roadblock, which is the HAB itself. So the insurgents have dropped a fob right here. And they've got this hat. This is their roadblock. They've been given an assortment of vehicles, uh, certain lodging supply points. Obviously, they've got some plenty of kits within their own squads to defend. They're also going to get a place a couple dishkas down within this fob radius. So they are defending this. The U.S. need to come in. They're going to start at Maine. The U.S. is going to start at their Maine, way up in the north there at the airfield. And they're going to come down, clear out this roadblock in Exville. Now, I'm not exactly sure where their exfil is. I cannot remember. <laughs> Do you have that readily available at all, Hyper? Uh, hold on a second real quick, and I'll figure it out. Uh, as you just go ahead and keep on talking, and I'll touch my tip of this. Yeah, I'm looking at the victory conditions. All right, exfil is going to be uh, I8K1, looks like. So that's going to be I8K1. All right, India 8, keypad 1, gotcha. 
Thank you for looking that up. No problem. EA keypad one. That's basically the alleys right above Insurgent. So they're getting yep. kind of into the island, out of the main city, onto the island, somewhere safe that they can be exiled. We In apologize meantime, for that, people. We're still learning this uh, off ourselves. <laughs> oh, yeah. They, it's This is... There wasn't a lot of time. This was a short notice. So props to everyone involved. Hammering Hutch and, and Lish both put in uh, hours yesterday to try and develop this operation. Yes. It's looking to be, it's looking like it's going to turn out pretty good. We were able to dink around a little bit on this map earlier once we got the servers updated. And it's, it's just amazing. You're on the commander himself, Karma Cut, for the insurgents. Looks like he's taken up an OP in a giant tall building right here next to the roadblock some of the other vehicles are moving around so yeah what they're doing right now is they're just setting their uh, cells up trying to find a good vantage point to see if, where the uh, US will be coming in and it looks like they're uh, calling it out and they're going to go live here in a little bit Insurgents are ready. I think the U.S. are ready. Minute. All right, we're going live at 118. That's about 40 seconds away. I'm going to be the camera following U.S. most of the time. Hyper's going to be following the insurgents. We're going to try to give you guys as much information as possible, discuss strategy and stuff like that, even though we're not quite sure what the strategy is going to consist of. The, the U.S. do get three open-top Humvees to combat the insurgents who are going to have two dish Kentuckys, as many of those motorcycles as they can loot from the ground, and, of course, the two dish gun placements. From the looks of it, the U.S. have chosen to bring only two Humvees. That's odd. Well, I mean, oh, they, and almost... they could have, he might have, Lish might have changed it up because I know they added one transport. Maybe they took away one Humvee. Yeah. Just so they could get more transport for the troops. And, and there's a broadcast for live, live, live. We are live. U.S. is rolling out. They're heading east out of the airfield. Looks like they're going to try and come in from the north side. That's going to be in the H column. The city is still, it's very distant right now. Can't even see anything down there when I look that way. Uh, I'll tell you what, they're definitely spread out through here in the city. They're kind of keeping it close to the palace here, but uh, they're a little bit spread out pretty, uh, quite a bit. Great stop, one. You're going to crash, dude. Like, with your battle, buddy. Help your cross a little too late. You went too late. Yeah, too late. Too late. As for mobility restrictions, the vehicles have got to use bridges. And as a matter of fact, if vehicles go in the water, they are going to die within a matter of seconds. Oh, that's even with the infantry as well. That hurts the infantry ah, as well now. Okay. So it's yeah, both. So it's and they hurt. So and the water on here is like lava. It okay. hurts really freaking quick. And we can look to see a lot of patient play because not it, there's it's urban warfare. You know these guys are going to have to check every corner, clear every building. Oh yes, definitely. They want to be sure. Oh, yeah. Let's see. Yeah, oh, other than I that, there's just not, not a lot of rules here. Yep. I see the U.S. coming in there from the uh, north. Yeah, I'm right over there on them looking, looking south. They're, they're looking at the main road with the Humvee. Trying to, Barton's jumping out. He's a squad leader. He's going to be getting in I'm there. I'm going to see if uh, Biff Tannen actually got eyes on these guys because he might have uh, might have seen them already. I can see all the red dots just at various elevations. They're just scattered throughout buildings over there. It's really cool. Oh, yeah. I think uh, Biff saw them. <laughs> Poor U.S. There's no cover whatsoever. No, no there's not. Desert. <laughs> it's nothing. They do have a squad at the refinery, too, on the north side. They're going to try and push around through there, I think. That's where their transport dropped them off. They keep pushing. All right, we're on All right, the like Biff is gonna you know, I don't know. Off. Who, yeah, I don't know who our cameras are, but we have a bunch today. Yeah, uh, last I bunch. heard, it was sixteen cameras we got during this match. Yeah, so a lot of lot of folks showed up for this event, and it's yes. really awesome. Thank everyone for coming here and watching and showing up and 
providing cameras and just participating in this. And you know what? Everyone's going to get this map soon enough. There's a free we got a free weekend coming up here, April 6th through the 10th, and it's going to be out by then. I think the date is April 5th. I'm not sure. I think we're waiting for the others. But I am just as excited as everybody else for it. So it's only a few days away for everybody else. Oh, yeah. For boys, I'm your GL. So if you get any it's going to be nice when this actually does go live. I'm your man. Oh, well, looks like uh, they're sending uh, some techies here over on the uh, island. Oh, over at the alleyway island there? Yeah. Ali's Island? Okay. Looks like it's That's just, the thing. Uh, oh. they, can't, they can't go any farther east in those, than that island because there's no bridges over there. It's nope. only one above to the north of this U.S. squad. Yeah, it's just it's their lodgies. Uh, they're just weren't doing lodgy runs. I thought they were uh, actual other techies that they're showing out there. Supplies back as soon as you can. Oh, we got U.S. coming in from the west side, too. Whose squad oh, is that? Boy. That's... Digit, nah, that's Schmidt's squad on the west side. I'm gonna sneak over here, see how they're coming through. And you can just see, I'm going really fast, but there are red blurs all over, I'm sure. Yeah. Or buildings, they're all over the place. You're on, you're on Schmidt, it's his squad I'm going to. We've got a Humvee over here as well. They're slowly sneaking through. There's a gas station here. Looks like, uh, oh, there's a Humvee. Yeah, it's like a little gas station shopping complex here. Schmitty's going over, Make making sure the Humvee's full. They're good to go. Most concealed positions possible. Barton's uh, bringing up a four-man crew up here on the north side. Trying to, it looks like he's just going to uh, be a lure for them, for everybody to look at. Oh, it might as well be, because he's in the oh. wide open. There's no cover whatsoever. Yeah, the people on the palace over here are starting to shoot at Barton's team. They're lighting them up right now. They're saying, hey, you can't come through there. They're running away. <laughs> you are They're not going to make it to that field. Yep. <laughs> hey, I'll turn around and run. There. See you later. Just Looks like Creepy is the only one left. Oh, yeah. Creepy's uh, over there. Dead stopped. Yeah, Creepy hit the deck early when they started taking shots. Let's get support. Roger. So I'm hovering over the palace right now. <laughs> they're kidding. They're, they're like, just see you later. <laughs> unloading on them. Yeah. <laughs> they are just running like the dickens. They're, they're so far away. I can see the bullets hit, and they're short. They're coming up short because it's such oh, a long on, shot. Copy. Have we lost Schmitty? Go ahead. Sorry. I'm... Oh, copy. Comms went quiet. My bad. I'm trying to think like we can bound across. Nidernade is keeping an eye on the... It looks like maybe this compound here to the right that you're calling out for these guys. So he might be able to spot them as they come through. Oh, is that to the west of, of the insurgents where Schmitty's coming in? Uh, oh, no. Uh, he sees them. He's firing at them. Nidernade's firing over at your... Uh, at the U.S. On the west to the east on the refinery. Oh, the refinery squad. Okay. Yeah, they've got yep. on the entries, exit he spotted the them. The so they know they're over there now. Yeah, oh, that's he's going to throw an RPG squad. at them. That's Digit Squad. They're all in that warehouse, most of them. Oh, here it comes. Oh, a little far. Missed, missed yep. by a little bit. Let's see, yeah, that's what he does this time. He looks like he might fucking uh, might fire another one. Yep, he's going to do another one. Oh, there you go. He put it away. Never mind. Barton's guys are lighting up the mosque now in the Humvee. I can hear the shots slinging away. Ooh, X-Bit's the... Uh, X-Bit took a shot. He's back. I don't know if that was the... I can't tell where he's at. There's so many red names over there. They get all intertwined. Uh, looks like oh, U.S. has got a nice little uh, oh, on the on the south side. Holy crap! Someone took a I didn't shot. See them coming over there. Umarex goes down. Good shot by the insurgents. Take him out. That's a long shot, and they're still slinging him. You can see the tracers coming. Barton's lobbing some up. Oh, that's Karma Cut shooting down. Barton and Karma Cut are shooting at each other. Barton sees him <laughs> up in the building. <laughs> now Creeping's unloading with the saw in his direction. Karma's just sitting there with his binoculars like, Yep, I'm not phased by it. I was going to keep on keep on looking. That's funny. Barton just pulled his binocs out and he said, uh, We can't push in from the north. We can't. There's nothing. There's no defense. We, we need yeah. a different plan. And he's right. It's. I'm surprised it's, they tried running up there. I know, right? I'm surprised wow. they hadn't actually tried throwing smokes, to tell you the truth. Well, it's just such a big area, and they've only got so many smoke grenades. Well, I, yeah, but I mean... It's they, so it, risky. It's true. That is true. But they don't all throw smokes out all at one time, either. 
Oh. Yep, Carmen's taking shots at uh, Humvee right now. It's starting to move off now. Scared it away a little bit. He's going back to the north side. Look at that north flank. See if they're uh, pulling in any closer or not. Yeah, that southern flank on the U.S. is coming in hard. Oh, uh, George, 1911 just asked, how can you play the new map already? Well, I think we're mainly being a... And you know what? Iron Taxi could probably answer that better if he's in chat, but... Um, we're kind of giving early access to test it out, give everyone a sneak peek at the same time. They're letting us stream it, and they want us to, to show you guys. It's going to be out in a few days, so everyone's going to get to play it. Yeah, we just got, uh, we, they let us have, uh, early access to this map right now for this weekend. And, and we're also a partner. We're partnered with OWI. They've made us an official partner. There's to help grow this squad game in, in general. And we, you know, we're doing random things. Like this one life event, which is just awesome. We love it. Biff is just getting lit up by this Humvee over here to the uh, west side. <laughs> okay. That Humvee is still slinging the it's... 50 cals. Covering the wolf, covering west. Oh, the refinery still, uh, squad is starting to move in now into the town. Yeah, we're still at a long engagement. In a little bit. Yeah, you're on Shadowed Ritual. He's the one leading the way. I don't know. They're moving slow. Mighty's got a got whole a squad here to the uh, north as well, or southwest as well, near him. He's got a lot of pushing to do from the northeast to get in there. But they're going slow. They're doing great. I think Lish's, Lish's command, he's down there reassuring everybody there's no rush. Take your time. Yeah, for sure. I can hear sure. him in local. Not quite sure what they're all saying. So the only way to get around is, is around the fence. Hey, this building looks really familiar. <laughs> it's from, this is the storage site in OP First Light. That's cool. Little storage warehouse. I can hear Lish giving command. He's kind of, he just wants to keep him sneaky. They want to get close. This is, it's going to turn into CQB. And he doesn't want to, he wants to be the one jumping them instead of getting jumped. That 50 cal of Bartons is still lighting up from the north. I don't know if they're hitting much. That bullet penetration is real on these buildings, though. Those 50 cals, the striker. It'll all go right through. I mean, you can <laughs> puncture. If you know they're in there, you might not oh, yeah. kill them, but you'll scare the hell out of them. Copy. We got the guy that was tracer. here. Yeah, even though you think you're safe behind behind that wall, you're really not. That yeah, It'll go right to you guys really quick. Oh, beautiful. Schmitty squad in the south, they're really... They're getting close. They're staying, they're staying together, too. You're yeah, they're definitely building. they've been going uh, building by building. I think Mighty got a couple eyes on him, but I think he's he's doesn't know exactly for sure where they're at now. No, oh, I'm out. Oh come on, Captain Match! You know Iron Taxi's a dev. He's right there. <laughs> Captain Matt is box boy. If anyone was wondering, into the urban buildings just to our southwest. Uh, you're team at the front can push up whenever Schmitty's being patient Lish is still giving great command he's doing a good job of keeping everybody you know uh, informed where they're going what they're doing what this plan still is so he's doing a great job all right command this is three we're gonna push to our southwest and see if we can uh, say again uh, can you give us a keep that yeah I jump back over I'm on shadowed ritual right now they are pushing into the big one they are yeah. so close to Woody and Sedingo and Nader Nade. This is, they're in the building right above them now. Oh boy. Oh That's, man. Oh boy. This is awesome. There's that little just drop in elevation, 10 feet. Burns is going up the stairs. He's got, he's got this entire squad in front of him. This is going to be great. Oh, Buckshot goes down to Burns. Burns gets him. Buckshot wasn't ready. He was just wow, peeking, I think. That's crazy. Did not see that coming. And just like that, 
I can hear all the local chatter just going crazy. I see all the local <laughs> in the bottom left. The U.S. are going nuts. Yeah, the Yenster side uh, over here, they're they're not really talking to local yet. They could be talking their squad comms, though. Uh, Tristan Peterson asked if squad is our primary title. Yeah, it is. This is We are called squad ops because we were developed out of squad. It, we were brought together because of squad, and the idea was a one-life event like you're watching right now. And it was a project that Karma Cut started. So with that one-life event, what that means is... We a ton of other games, though. Yeah. Oh yeah, go so ahead. De describe that one the life one life form. Uh, means uh, that as soon as you die in this in this round, you're done. You cannot join back in. You are not able to uh, respawn at all. From there, you'll go to, straight to uh, admin cam, which we have set up through our uh, uh, forums to get you guys access to that. So you'll just go into admin cam and uh, you'll undef in Discord to talk to other people who have uh, uh, been killed throughout the op. So you can talk to these people. Yeah, we've worked, we've worked really hard to make this a fun event for everyone, even after you die. We give yeah. everyone admin cam when you die, so that you can go into the cam and watch. If I could get a read and they'll be flying around just like I am. Yep, you'll see them uh, flying on our screen, uh, passing around in front of us. It's best you can, don't get too close. They have uh, and all sorts. We're put, we're, uh... Roger. Cop. Cop. This Roger. southern uh, flank is still... Just, right, just hanging out in this building. They haven't pushed in yet. I think Barton went down. He was a squad leader. Karma just There's... announced over uh, in squad comms that he's going to try to ping this Humvee over here. Humvee's moving. There is... There's no nonsense. Muff, show us the map. Alright, I'll show you the map. I'm going to back out a little bit. Oh, this map? Here, I'll show you the map first. This village is really cool. I, sh I showed that earlier. But the city is where the, the awesomeness really is. Yeah, is you know going uh, around actually, trying to find a different, a different area now. I found a little checkpoint up here also to the north that the U.S. has. There it is right there. That's kind of cool. Down. In It's like Foxtrot 6, maybe. Barton's uh, leftover squad that uh, was there to the north has made it to that field and are actually inside the uh, village now. There we However, go. they got to be careful. They have a, a, disc, uh, a technical right there next to them. All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna go back into it. We got action. I'll show you guys the map like between rounds or, or shortly after. It's very cool. It, like here's the view of the big city up above, and it's really awesome. Oh, Dishka, who was that? Remain in that Dishka. Hammered Hebrew in took in down Dishka. Nash right here. This is one. With the bullet penetration, like we were talking about. And, yeah, they pretty much wiped out this northern flank now. Yeah, with Nash going down, that was, it was a small squad. They were a four-man element. Yeah. And they, you know what? They did their job. They were a distraction. That is oh, definitely sure. what they were. And now you can see uh, Shadowed Ritual and the squad he's with. Lish is there. I'm not sure who their squad leader is. I cannot remember. You know, it, it might be Digit. It was Digit's squad. Is that who, that's who this was. I'm not sure what uh, what Shmini Squad's doing. I mean, they've been held this in the building for a long time now. I don't, I'm not for sure if they're being told to stay there or what. But there, it looks like they're taking some... Uh, oh, they're uh, actually right. taking uh, training shots now. Uh, it looks like ODT down. took down uh, Doe House. Doe House down. Nice shot. We've got He's a like humpy in the south, too. Yep. It's decipher driving with Google Treks at the gunner's seat. Let's say get up on this road north. This is this is the main street. We're looking down like the main street here, where a lot of action happens. I'll even give you guys a little zoom in down. It's really, I mean, it could be open. Look at all those buildings. Yeah, I'm you surprised. Can see OD tap and mighty. You can see Karmica way up in the other one. You can get in all those buildings. It's it's risky to say the least, to, to just saunter down these roads. That's why they're yeah. being very careful. Yeah, the U.S. Is, did lose uh, Squad 3 leader. Uh, that was Barton creeping. Yeah, that's their whole squad. They're down. I think Digit's gone wow. down for Squad 2. He was their squad leader. Big Jimmy HD is now in charge of that squad. 
As far as I can for see, the most uh, part, look, go ahead. For the most part, the U.S. are located in two buildings now. They're starting to branch out in the southwest. Some these guys are. Here comes Jay Remick. Jay Remick. Oh, Jay Remick is just oh, he eats house. Oh, wow. What a nade. Yeah. That was a good one. Just blew him. He was on a race. roll. You can see the smoke clearing. The neural, he's not sure. There could be more. That's the thing. They never know. Yeah. Oh, it's what's going on here? Holy cow. Man, goodness. Tactical the... Brit. Wow. Tactical Brit just took someone out, and Nacho is right there next to him. Yep. He's Let's bandaging. See what he does. Uh -oh, oh, here comes put... Nacho. Uh -oh. He hears the bandage. Oh, he gets Tactical uh -oh. Brit. He got him. Oh. That was he pretty the good. Bandage. That's yep. what it was. You know you got a few seconds at least there when that happens. Oh, yeah. All right, Big Jimmy squad with Lish as command. They're kind of pinned down. They just said they're pinned down. And he's not wrong. There's burns across the street to, I think, a, which way is that? Like northeast, east? In this building right here. And there's a couple tall buildings by each other. Woody's in this yep. other short one. This southern flank is uh, starting to push up now. Getting a little bit closer to Mighty. Everybody get your pen out. Jot down the number real quick. So far, uh, INS's uh, squad leaders are all still alive. Well, that's good for them. The U.S. are still spread out really well, but they're always oh, oh, yeah. keep seeing them taking casualties. Those windows, they got to get in and clear. Yeah, this Humvee is uh, starting to pin down Karma now. I'm going to move in a second. Hold on, I'm going to move. I'm gonna move. Oh, Karma came out. On, on the courtyard flag as well. Looks like Karma's gotten to a little bit of cover. The oh, there goes uh, the squad. Them. Yep. Humvee's There's, giving them cover so they can push across. That's great. They're advancing and still working together. You know, it gets it gets chaotic. Just because there's so many buildings and there's so many different points of contact. Looks like Karma cuts on a Dishka now. Dishka yeah, I'm keeping an eye on him. See if maybe he might move that get, go uh, over to this uh, Humvee here. Oh, he might spot him. No, 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 no. Okay. They reloaded the. There are. They're reloading. The Is he driving up the street? Yeah. Carmen didn't see him. Oh, oh, Carmen sees him now. Oh, goodness. He's unloading on him right now with the technical. Man, he put oh, some good fire. Uh, yeah, he about. did. Now, Humvee's bugging out now. Karma got smart and he just jumped out that disco really quick, just so that way uh, he didn't get any top shots uh, fired at him from the other people. Man, I got some good hits on the Humvee. Over. <clears throat> yeah, that Humvee's gonna. <clears throat> the insurgents are doing a great job right now, being defensive. One is uh, five effective. Oh, Roger that one. Yeah, that Humvee's gonna try to relocate somewhere else now. That's good. He Karma did see him and got some good shots, so that's good of them to move. In the meantime, Schmitty's squad can they've got a good angle if they look out yeah. in the right direction. They'll be able to see them. Schmitty might be able to see this palace. Wood. You see these people up here. Oh, Cloud Void's taking shots from the northeast of his location. I think it's northeast. North, maybe. He's calling them out, too. He called the shots. Everyone's pro. Yeah. And if you go, you pick the window. Yep, there's a few of them over there. Odie Tap, Biff Tannen, Karma Cut. CG Fu is way out there in another building. <laughs> you know, it's, it's risky. There's so many different places. It really you. is. You know, imagine imagine just being driving your Humvee down the road. and Any window could have an RPG in it just to drop you right now. Yep. Oh, they knocked out Google, the gunner. Google Trex goes down. Yeah, those poor open top Humvee gunners. It's it's rough when they got that altitude advantage on you. A lot more head oh, exposure. Sure. And so the mobility matters. Taking you know, hitting the brakes, taking the shots when you can. <laughs> I part time part time you just fell off the roof on accident. <laughs> he got a little he too alive? careless. Yeah, he's alive. He just got a little too careless. That's good. All right, I'm gonna I'm back over at Lish and Big 
Jimmy is leading his uh, the remainder of Digi Squad. There's only three of them left in the yeah, compound. Yeah, Ham leads. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. We got Big Jimmy, Lish, and the Neural to their south. Gosh, I don't know which way is which right now in the middle of the city. South or north somewhere. It's yeah, Burns is over to their uh, east, uh, southeast of them right now. Jeffy's over to the their north. Uh, Hamley is sitting on top of the palace right now and trying to keep an eye on Jimmy's uh, crew over there, trying to see if he can get some eyes on them. However, he doesn't see him. Burns looks like he's going to kind of be sneaking up on them from their south. Nacho's definitely got eyes on him in that building. He's trying to fall back right now. Oh, yeah, there we go. Cloud Void slinging some lead. He's got that saw out. Suppressing OD tap. Oh, they're shooting nades at him. Get out of the building. You know what? And uh, even if they are just doing it for suppression, that's fine. Oh, you yeah. To, you want to keep them to. from sticking their head out that window. Yep. Oops. Oh. So you know what? We, the, uh... Those smokes work for crossing the road. They really do. We When we were playing so, a little bit earlier, those smokes worked. Yep. Uh, th oh shoot! Smoke or uh, Soap is going to try to get a hit on this uh, Humvee real quick. He's got his RPG out right now. They spotted it. Is that over by? Yeah, it's over guys? on the uh, east side of the compound. Uh, okay, gotcha. Road. Yep, by Jimmy's crew. It looks like. Oh, it looks like. Uh... Bad guy just the oh wow! Uh, Who is that? So Odie Tap. Odie Tap took him out. The or no, Burns. Gunner? I'm sorry. That was Burns. Burns yeah, took okay, out Burns. The, uh, yep, took out the uh, person from the Humvee. So that Humvee's dead in the water now. Let me check. Let's take a look at kills here. Scroll up. The U.S. has seven. The insurgents have 17. So good work by the insurgents. Oh, they are just sure. defending the heck out of this. And I, I mean, what do you expect? I mean, that's going to happen. To come into their area. Yeah, exactly. And with all these buildings all around them, I mean, it's just hard to get anywhere in here. And the big thing is the U.S. hasn't even gotten close to that roadblock. Not at all. In fact, the, the insurgents are pushing out towards the U.S. now, it looks like. Even Karmica's running across the road to the east yep. and trying to get a better view. I think he's going to cut him off over here. Jip, uh, Big Jimmy's... Uh, Team is getting ready, or is coming out now. They're pushing down to the uh, western side of the compounds. Somebody just got Bersang as he was peeking. Oh, nice. To pull back to my current pause, this block over. Got it. Comrade is calling for uh, uh, team two to come or uh, squad two to come over to him, help him out a little bit. Let's just tell these guys now. Yeah, just engage as best you can and try and push. Yeah, in. he knows they're they're getting hurt and. Boy, it's a tough one. This is a yeah. tough one to push on. Roger. Yeah, I think uh, I think Armor Cut knows that it's down to the last people and that they're starting to group up a little bit on one side of the uh, town. For the uh, deep door in front of us, possible contact. Well, uh, what direction is that? All right, let's go. We'll move. Uh, west, 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 west. We'll break. Lish is leading the charge with his last few guys behind him. Oh, I'm going to go over here and check on Mighty, see what he's going to do here. I think he might be able to spot a Big Jimmy's team coming across this uh, area. Oh, oh, here comes some shots. Yeah. Mighty did see uh, Jimmy's team. I think he's going to rush him. Axton Technical Vehicles. I've seen a few comments about optics, and I just don't think that the squad ops is ever going to use them, except for certain oh. situations and scenarios. It's definitely a big topic of discussion, and it always gets brought up. But for now, we keep them out, and that's probably the way it's going to stay, with the exception of vehicles. I'm following Vilsane right now. He's got he's kind of close over here by uh, Jimmy's uh, crew. He might be might be going to try to press on him. I'm not for sure yet. Well, in the meantime, it's only a couple more U.S. soldiers that have died, and the U and the insurgents are just kicking butt. Yeah, we're down to Big Jimmy street, HD, Deadly Seal, and Lish. I think we're down to three guys. Uh -oh. Yeah, three guys left for the insurgents. Vilsane might be coming up uh, behind Lish here. Lish is making a break for it. Yeah, Lish is staying mobile. He's 
that's how he stayed alive. He's keeping on his feet. Oh, oh. Bill Saints right oh. there. Yeah. Oh, Deadly Seal might take Dead him out. Deadly Seal's going to peek that corner. Let's see if he peeks it. Oh, wow. He, oh. <laughs> he just moved away just in time. Oh, no. Here now, comes now Bill Saints might get him. Oh, oh Bill Saints. Oh. Kiss him. Yeah, we got enemies close to the oh, wow. Man. That's some good timing. Yep. Oh, here comes Big oh, Jimmy. Here comes Big Jimmy. Oh, Bill oh, Sane looking at him. Jimmy he was well. looking, yeah, Bill Sane was looking up in the tower. There was nothing, or up in the building. There was nothing there. It's down to Lish, the command He's, Lish. Yep. The one man I command think he band. Hears him. Here it comes. Yep. Here comes the trade, maybe. Oh, oh, oh Karma Cut. <laughs> Karma Cut shooting out of freaking yep. Dishkateki, lighting up, just oh, penetrating oh, the walls. He's trying to hit the first floor can. right now. Oh, oh, there he goes, goes down. Took Take it down. out from a techie from the west. Yep, I think. Is that everybody? That's going to uh... do it. That's it for the... Yeah, yep. I think that's it. That's it. It's a good game. Good round yeah, one. That was a really good round. Well, that was round one. I think we'll see some GGs in chat here. Yeah, we should be starting to see it here in a second. There. There you go. Now, now get the ball rolling. Yeah. <laughs> well, that was a good one. The insurgents clear, clearly laid the smack down on the U.S. trying to come in. This is their oh, town. For sure. For sure. I'm going to roll the map. Yep. Never mind. Someone's doing it. Let's get this restarted. Uh, so... With that, it looks like the uh, surgeons was able to uh, withstand the uh, onrush of uh, the U.S. Uh, people. Uh, however, the way we play our ops events is not is, isn't whether if you win or lose. It's about immersing yourself inside these uh, these types of ops. Uh, yeah, it, and, and, and to have fun with about. it. Yeah, we don't You're care about right. winning or losing. It's more about. Hey, let's go out and have a fun time. Get ourselves immersed in this role of that we're, that you're playing, whether that be the medic, the squad leader, the commander, or the 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 lat. You know, that's what we want you guys to do. Not not worry about who's winning or who's losing. We want you to be immersed in your role. Very much so. We're rolling in for round two. And let's right. since we got a little break, we'll talk about some other stuff like check us out at squadops.gg. We've got a Discord channel. There's always people in there willing to answer questions and help out and help you get involved with this with this uh, community. Uh, it's really easy to join the operations. There's one SOTT class, that's Squad Ops Tactics and Training. There's our basic course. takes about, what, 40 minutes, 45 minutes? Uh, it's and, roughly uh, about 40 in. minutes to an hour, depending on the class okay. size. All right. Someone wants more map? Let's see more map. Yep, go ahead. Go to map. Or we'll map. go up to the U.S. airfield where they start. Um, I forgot. I was going to say something. I totally forgot. Totally forgot. <laughs> that's Okay. We got all data top. Oh, for sure. You can register on um, our website. Oh. Yep. Go ahead. As I was going to brief. Go ahead. Yeah. Register on our website. Definitely join the Discord. That's where you're going to find a lot of us hanging out and talking. We're uh, the to, US to, go ahead. No, I was going to say, in order to find us uh, in our Discord, uh, if you go to our forums, uh, squadups.gg, you will find our Discord link in there. Uh, it'll specif uh, specifically say Discord. Just click that. It'll send you an invite to automatically join into our Discord. Uh, we also have a Twitter page that we have up, Squad Ops dot, or uh, Squad Ops Twitter page. If you type that into Google, you'll find it really easily. And we also have a Facebook page as well, uh, along with our obviously our Twitch stream here. Uh, something that we've been trying to uh, get uh, get going and get some people uh, recognizing what we have uh, available for them. Uh, in order to join our events, like Muff was uh, briefing earlier, we do have SOTT Basic that you have to go through. We uh, hold that every other week. Uh, our next one is going to be on the... Uh, wait a second. Let me, let me figure that out real quick. The next one is going to be uh, the 13th of April. And then we'll also have another session on the 15th between our uh, rounds on that day, between our sessions. Oh, and yes, Lucas Salami. This is an Al Basra sneak peek. You got it. We're running oh, a squad ops event. Operation Cru or D Desperado right now.
So I'm going to go ahead and go inside the town here and show you exactly what it all looks like from uh, up above. Yeah, I'm kind of flying by the southern side right now, going towards Insurgents Main. And these bridges are key. The water will destroy your vehicles. Yes. So you can, that's, <laughs> you cannot that's go through the water so right now. So even though looking up from above, it seems small. It's it's <laughs> running around that ground. It's really, really big. And you have to be careful of how you're moving through this city. Uh, don't you don't want to stick on the main roads if you do if you do have to cross the main road you want to make that quick and hopefully you have somebody covering you while you're doing that because anybody could be anywhere inside these buildings sitting on top of the third fourth fifth whatever floor they want to be on looking down at you so you want to definitely take care and and definitely go through these alleyways and uh, try to minimize your exposure from building to building but it's a very fun map to play on very very fun map It really is. It's a good time. Uh, yeah, like you were saying earlier, the water, uh, the way they have this map set up uh, with the water is if a vehicle goes into it, uh, it's going to take damage, and even the infantry. Uh, it, and it'll kill you quick if you uh, try to run into the water. So <laughs> that's definitely not key to success if you want to try to do that. You'll definitely get uh, mowed down real quick by that water. Yeah, I think uh, Johnny Johnny Omaha has talked about this. Basically, basically looks like a death cemetery for moving containers or shipping containers but what it's not actually a river or a bridge oh i, I see what you're saying all right all right and before this next round gets started we're going to keep flying around a little bit, but we're going to show you the SOTT basic trailer just so you get an idea of what you're going to do. Just join Jensen's Reigns, go over some quick combat tactics, battle spacing, stuff like that. Uh, it'll be very informative. Penn's going to roll that for us now. He's our cameraman. We'll be right back after it's over. <laughs> 